Hi, this is William at Puget Systems, and today we're going to be taking a look at an error that some of our customers have been running into in PhotoScan and how to fix it. Okay, so here we can run Adjusoft PhotoScan, and then within the Tools drop-down, if you go to Preferences, and then the GPU tab, you'll see this is where you can select the different graphics cards. You can have uh, any or all of them selected here. And then at the bottom, there's this Use CPU when performing GPU accelerated processes option. And that's what's the problem that we've found. Uh, when that's enabled, it looks like we get errors within PhotoScan when processing. And I'll uh, show you an example of that here. When we go to Build Dense Point Cloud, click OK. This is with the GPUs and the CPU option enabled. You'll see I'm going to fast forward through time a bit here, but we get these, uh, these GPU errors. There, you can see it right there, it pops up, there's kernel errors, and then here in a moment we'll get uh, some CUDA stream errors, I believe. Yep, there we go, CUDA stream destroy failed, and so there's the errors. And as you can see, leading up to that we had CPU utilization pretty much maxed out, and it just seems to be something in PhotoScan where if the GPUs are being used and the CPU is allowed to be used at maximum, eventually, it's sometimes just a few seconds in, sometimes a few minutes in, you'll get these errors. Uh, in older versions of PhotoScan, prior to 1.3, there was actually another option in that uh, tool's preferences area to disable a few cores, which would just uh, prevent PhotoScan from using them, leaving them free, and that seems to fix this, and the option is gone now, but there's actually another way to go about it. Uh, you can actually manually restrict what cores PhotoScan or any other program has access to through something called Affinity in Windows. We'll show you that here next. You go to Task Manager, and you go to the Processes tab here, and you right-click on PhotoScan, and go to details. That'll take you over to the details tab where you can actually see the photo scan thread and if you right click there and go to um, set affinity from there you'll be able to actually control what cores PhotoScan has access to. By default it's all of them but you can uncheck a few in here and then that will keep PhotoScan from using all of them. And uh, We did a quick test here where we disabled half the cores and PhotoScan did just fine. Uh, the old recommendation in previous versions of PhotoScan was to disable one core per GPU you had. I don't know if that's still the right number. We haven't done enough detailed testing yet on that, but uh, I'd recommend doing one of two things, either going ahead and removing a few cores from PhotoScan and Affinity, or just go ahead and disable that CPU option and just let the GPUs do the brunt of the processing. Either of those should keep you from having the errors we showed here.